Welcome to the Planetary Calendar 2020 Astrology Forecasts. The calendar comes in three sizes. The extra large wall size, the traditional wall size that's been around since 1949, and the pocket version, which was created at the request of one of the users in 2020. We introduced the Planetary Calendar Day Planner. Inside the front cover are the signs of the zodiac and the birth dates at which time the sun is in those signs because the reader will need that in using the calendar. In the Welcome to the Calendar section, it talks about the history of this remarkable calendar which has been in print for over 70 years. We're skipping to page 26 towards the back of the calendar because this is where the instructions begin about how to achieve maximum benefit from this calendar. It includes various different features, especially focused on the day block and on the compact ephemeris. An important and unique feature in the calendar is the lunation meditations, essential oils, and placements. And this is part of a healing system that we have built into the calendar. And it works with a meditation for each of the lunations, an essential oil recommendation, and a placement, some place in the home or the workplace to activate that area to help people clear out problems that might have developed in their lives or past. Next to the book catalog of other titles that we produce is the key to planting and wine tasting to give you an idea of which moons most benefits certain types of plant and that's based upon biodynamic farming and then the best days for wine tasting are there because one does not live by the stars alone. The planetary calendar is based upon the astrology. At the top are two forecasts. First, the lunation forecast based upon the new and the full moon and then the days to watch and this is for your overall community. This is explains to you the ebb and flow of the month. Below that are the lunation recommendations, the meditations, the essential oil recommendations, and the spot within the 12 terrestrial houses to place them. Below that is a key. It gives you the astrological glyph and then the English word for the signs, for the planets, and for the major aspects. Then we come down to the day blocks. Now the day blocks show you the data for each day. And that's why it's important to be able to read the, the key. Within the day blocks, you will find things like the white circle days and the black box days. These are a quick way to know if things are going smoothly or are more challenged. Also within the day box is, are these letters and the letters A, B, C. You'll find them up here, A, B, C. So as you're going along, when you see these letters appear, you know that I need to read that section today. And that way you know that you stay up on what's going on. On the lower part of the calendar also is the compact ephemeris. It tells you where the planets are on the first day of the month by sign um, and by motion, retrograde or direct. It's in both English and in glyphs as a way to help people understand and learn how to use the glyphs effectively. Finally, inside the back cover is the ordering information. So you can order next year's planetary calendar or day planner. And we hope that it guides you gracefully and safely through your year. As if the calendar didn't have enough features. The monthly forecasts are supplemented by online videos with the author astrologers, Ralph and Lonnie Demetrius. You can also round out your astrological experience by watching episodes of their television show, Astrologers Chatting Over Coffee.